give all praises to Yahweh Hashem Yahshad. Double honor to the elders that rule well. You know, much love to all the brothers all around the world that's pushing this truth and sincerity. We're the proud side the downfall of America and expose the wickedness of America and wake up the 12 tribes of Israel the sun down. The Negroes, Latino, and the natives where they are. Alright? So we're gonna bring out some news. Say pray as watch as well as pray. We being watched through. And we're gonna talk about some of the wickedness that's going on. We're we'll gonna bring out a local news in Trinidad. I'm gonna show you how wicked Trinidad really is, man. Alright? It said mother claims child. The child is two years old. Sexually abused at daycare. Alright? And this was in the Guardian. It said a two-year-old child is alleged to have been sexually assaulted while at daycare in the East Trinidad. The child mother is now making a desperate appeal to relevant authorities to pursue investigation and have her child molested. Arrested so the justice can't prevail. So when I first heard the story, I couldn't read it without my voice cracking, man. I almost, I almost got emotional, man. Huh? You know, I know I did get emotional on it, man. Huh? I know brothers have children and so on. I have children myself. Brothers got babies on the way and so on. So let me read the story right here. It said, incident allegedly took place on February 23rd. Speaking with TT Guardian yesterday, the, ch the child's mother said she dropped her off at a daycare and picked her up that same day, about 6 p.m. She claimed that while on the way home, while on the way, her daughter began crying and pulling at her parents' accent for it to come off. So she was asking her mother, they're going home, hey, mommy, take my pamphlets off, take my pamphlets off. Right? Well, first, I thought it strange. When I picked her up, my child seemed very angry. By the time we got home, she cried more. So her grandmother took off her pamper and got a shock of her life. When she saw blood in the pamper, I checked my child carefully and found that her gentle area was swollen and pinkish in color. And this is a, a daycare. You know, when you leave a child in daycare, the parent has confidence saying, my child is gonna be all right. But the child's vagina was what swollen, right, and pinkish. So the mother said the toddler was taken to area hospital where she was medically examined by the district medical officer who confirmed that she had been sexually molested. So the child been sexually molested in daycare, man. It's not only going to Trinidad, but all different parts of the world, man. Because it's a demonic kingdom that we living in, man. This is Ezekiel chapter 9, verse 4. And the Lord said unto him, Come on. Go through the midst of the city. Through the midst of Jerusalem, uh -huh. I set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and cry uh -huh. for all abominations that be done in the midst thereof. Yeah, so we cry for all the abomination that's going on in this earth, man. That's wickedness, man. That's wickedness, man. It's like the little girl from Virginia at the age of two. What is this world coming to, man? It's coming to an end, man. That's what happens when the wicked rules the earth, man. Because when you have a shot come, man, he gonna establish through his men, he gonna establish starting with your how you have a shot, righteousness on earth, man. You can't believe your child in daycare, man. And they be wondering why you would send your skip your kids off to school. Because the school, the school system is wicked, huh? The school system is wicked. These little girls are having um, sex in school, man. Let's gonna dream this real quick. It said the 20 years, the 20 years old mother said the following day the child father 
went to a daycare to collect the child's personal belongings. But when he returned home with them, she noticed that the child's clothes, which were wore the day alleged incident, it was washed and bleached. So the evidence that they had, they washed it and what in bleach. In bleach, huh? And y'all brothers out there, if y'all know you got little girls, man, you gotta be, you gotta be overprotective. You got little girls, man. Having little girls and little boys, that's a different, that's a different ball game, man. That's a different ball game when you got little girls, man. Now give us your job or have a daughter, man. Give us your job or have a daughter. Yeah, yeah. Give me that real quick. I don't know, man. If it was me personally, I think I would turn that daycare upside down. Man. I think I would turn that daycare upside down. Man. I think I probably got locked up too, man. Uh, this is uh, Ecclesiastical chapter 7, verse 24. Yeah, go ahead. As thou daughters have a care of their body. So now, if you got a little daughter or a daughter on the way, you got to have care of her body, man. Fathers have to be in that daughter's life, man. That daddy has to be in that daughter's life, man. That's why these little girls were running rampant, having sex at a young age and so on, getting pregnant at a young age and so on, yes. man. That's why things is out of order. The daddy's not around, man. The father's not around. I know daddy's got to work and so on and so on, but you got to take a break and say, you know what? What's going on in my house? What's going on with my little girl? How's she doing? So and so and so. It's more responsibility than working your ass off, man. You gotta take hold of your house, too, man. You gotta take charge of your house. How are you gonna move your house out if you can't handle your own household, man? This is the most of the time that takes the father's out of the place, too. That's right, huh? This is Ecclesiastes. And that's why, that's why they run in, those cops running rampant over there in Babylon. Shoot and shoot and kill, man. That's why they ran and running rampant out in, in Babylon, man. And most of the prison system is what? It's uh, men. Black men. Or is it like men, I should say. Because when you take the head out, guess what? The, the body's going with us. Good, I'm shut, bro. Ecclesiastes chapter 7, verse 24. And no daughters. Have a care of your body. Come on. And show not thyself cheerful towards them. Yeah, so you got a little daughter, man. Don't show, don't show yourself cheerful to your little daughter, man. They say, oh, wait, I got a candy for you today. I got some new show, I got some new. Come on, man. You got to be that little girl, man. Because once you said those principles to that little girl, man, guess what? She don't want a, a husband just like my dad. Straight, tough. A man that holds more of those grounds, man. But if you let your daughter, give your daughter a lot of slack or whatever, that's what? That next man, she, she gonna run over her man. She gonna run over her daddy, man. This is us. So like she gonna run over the husband. Fuck you. This is right, right, us, chapter 26, verse 10. But then she was bored that I want a good man. But when a good man came along, you ran him out. What you dealing with a punk ass nigga? Because you want to have it your way with that husband, man. That's why these black women is out of order, man. And they are worthy of death, man. That's that right. You can't stand these black women on this island and on four corners of the earth, man. And the funny thing is, when a man puts his foot down, he comes a black woman. Why are you so hard on him? Why are you so hard on sheep? A black woman wouldn't let the husband do his job. Right, huh? Ecclesiastes chapter 26 verse 10. Good, huh? If thy daughter be shameless, keep her straight. She be what I mean. If she be shameless, she keep her straight. Yeah. Lest she abuse herself through over much liberty. Yeah, she abuse herself over much liberty, man. A lot of your parents don't know where your kids at till this very day, man. Your kids just run the damn streets, man. Your daughter just running trains on, on three men at one time. And who runs the polo industry? Black woman, huh? Latino woman. Right. Watch over her. Watch over her intricate eye. And yeah, I'm marvel not if she trespass. Trans yeah, don't go over her. And your daughter, if she trespass, man. You beat her ass, man. 
Her mother said she had been in constant contact with the police, but was told by them that they were yet to get in touch with the owners of the daycare. I, I, I ain't gonna lie, man. I ain't gonna lie. Turn that, turn that police. Just the hey, it's really sucks, man. It really sucks. Cause if it was in America, man, they they would shut down that daycare down until they come to a solution, man. They talking about they ain't get a hold of the daycare owner, man. The little girl, two years old, got popped. And the bitch ass cop said, we ain't get hold of the owner. It really sucks out here, man. Bridget Mike we don't have it easy out here, man. The justice system out here sucks. No forensic, no nothing out here, man. You really have to put your trust in your high while your house shot to survive on this island, man. Right. right. You really have to put your trust. There's no justice in the justice system. Because uh, this was like woman, child. It was it was the saw child. Yeah. Or the Chinese child, you would see how fast the police would have find the daycare owners of them. Because the owners of that place. Because I was an intro like Ted. I'm a police car like Ted. If they get a paper, if they get a money, they go and investigate. So Esau and Elam were showing them money, so they want to investigate. But you know, Jake said, we had a money to try them. So them say, fuck that. And that's your own fucking finance system. So like, yeah, that's the police. And them say, fuck you. No, the majority of the police system is Jake. Exactly. Jake hates Jake. Exactly. Jake hates Jake. There's a Proverbs chapter 29 verse 2 When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice But when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn yeah, The people mourn, man The people mourn because the wicked is in, is in control, man The wicked is in control And it's easy to, uh, say, divert jakes All you gotta do is jakes and give them something free like homes And they, they forget about the issues that is at hand, man you know what I'm saying? 